Hello and welcome to Easy Drupal. Today I'm going to show you how to uninstall a module uh, using the command line. Well, I'll show you both options actually. So in Drupal 7, to uninstall a module, you would disable it first and then remove the code manually if you needed to. But in Drupal 9, it's different. You have to um, explicitly say, I want to un uninstall a module. So I've got a module installed called MetaTag, which I installed for this demo. So we're going to find that. There it is, MetaTag, it's enabled. And there are some sub-modules there, but we don't need those. So to uninstall it through the admin interface, we go to uninstall. And we should be able to find it, hopefully. Meta tag, there it is. We can click on this here. We can click uninstall and it will give us the option to carry on. We're not gonna do it that way. We're gonna do it through the command line, but you can do it through the interface. It's best to do it through the command line because you can then remove the code if you definitely don't need it uh, using Composer. So let's switch over to our command line. I'll just cancel that. Some rather weird sunlight coming onto my face. Okay, so this is our terminal. Uh, now, from the root of your site, uh, you will have Composer installed. You should hopefully have Drush installed as well. If you haven't, I'll link to a video that shows you how to do that. So we can confirm that we've got Drush installed by doing Drush status. And that will tell you a few bits of information. This is a local site, so you can't hack into it using my database name. So to uninstall a module, we use Drush PM colon uninstall and the name of the module, which is meta tag. I can't spell, it's Drush, not whatever that was I just wrote. There you go, successfully uninstalled meta tag. So uh, that will now no longer show in the admin interface, but we want to actually remove the code as well, just to tidy things up. And we can use Composer for that. We do Composer, remove, Drupal slash meta tag. There you go. That's removed the code for meta tag and that's no longer in our system at all. Okay, that's how you remove a module using Drush and Composer on the command line. Um, it's pretty easy. It's the best way to do it. I'll put the commands down below. If you're stuck, drop me a message. Thanks very much for watching. See you soon.